6.30 a.m. and it sounds like on the next 40 acres over there's two big elk bugling. I think they're getting ready to fight. I'm gonna go see if I can get it on camera. Man, that grass is tall. Man, I'm out of breath. Walking fast. jump out of the RV and practically run. It takes a while to walk a quarter mile. Sounds like there's like three or four of them.
see if I can get closer. over there. I think he walked around. They heard me. Man, I thought I was going to get a good shot up close to that bull. There's another one. Yeah, they see me now. There's no point in me hiding anymore. They know I'm here. Five of them were uh, ten points. There goes one. There's a young bull. Yep, there's a giant bull. Oh man, it's too bad this GoPro doesn't zoom in. Oh man, he's at least a freaking 12 point. Wow. Oh my gosh, he's turning towards me. Okay, I gotta be careful. He's He's gonna protect his cows. Come on, dude, get out in the sun. Let me get a look at you. Oh yeah, you can see his rack. His rack is equal to his height. That is incredible. Wow, man, I got goosebumps after seeing that guy. Okay. Yeah, I can see the tree he was standing next to. Wow, I would not want to have him charge me. Man, I wish I had a camera with a zoom. <laughs> that would have been awesome. Yeah, they know they're safe on this land. That's why they're here. Yeah, I can see their tracks all over the place. Man, that's some big animals. Well fed, too. Well fed. Watching my six. Yep, there's more over there. Make sure I don't get taken by a bull. Oh, look at that, there's a little baby. Yeah, this is what I need to be really careful because there could be a bull hiding. I remember a story long ago when I lived in Flagstaff. A car on I-17 was attacked by a bull elk protecting a herd coming across. Okay, I'm gonna get down, they don't see me. Okay, I've got a chance of seeing the mama and the baby.
he's not running off. He's watching me. He knows I'm here. Let me see if I can get a little closer. Yeah, I'm in the shadow. He doesn't see me. 